Hello, huge movie fanatic Nate coming your way with some very, very exciting news for us slasher fans, us fans of early 80s slasher cinema. This is a title which I have, if you've been watching my reviews over the years, I've been mentioning very often when I do a review of a super duper arrow video release of a horror movie or even other, probably even other just Blu-rays of old 80s slasher films. This is a title that I usually before the review ends oftentimes I'll end up mentioning which is the 1981 or 2 film by the name of The Slayer which has not had an official release basically since the 80s on video and even that if it was paired with the Federal and Ray movie Scalps was cut in order to fit both of those movies on one VHS tape. I've actually got a standalone VHS of The Slayer which is also cut so I didn't actually see the whole movie until someone posted the whole movie on, um, I didn't know it was so cut at the beginning like that. And someone posted years ago the whole movie on YouTube and I was like, oh wow, that they cut stuff out of the versions I have. And it's really weird that they cut stuff out of the single tape version of this movie. Um, but at any rate, it's just like I saw a comment on blue-ray.com in the comments of this particular news, if someone said, you know, the only version or the best version they own of this movie is just a version downloaded from YouTube, I can say the same. I did the same thing and that was the only way to really own, for me, as far as I know, the full version of The Slayer, which is absolute, as I've mentioned over and over and over in other reviews of other movies and Blu-rays, in my opinion, absolutely just a fantastic, underrated slasher movie with absolutely fantastic atmosphere and just a very simplistic, very small cast. And I can't say, you know, I'm, I won't review the movie now. I'll review the movie after this fantastic, presumably fantastic Blu-ray comes out. But get this, my number one pick to release this movie on Blu-ray is the outfit that's putting it out. Yes, that's right. Arrow Video is going to release the Slayer in a new 4K master from the original camera negative. That is correct. That's the news we're being given at this point. The best possible news for this movie that I can even imagine. Um, it has been my dream for the last several years ever since, well maybe, I've only been um, buying Arrow Blu-rays for probably maybe a year and a half at this point, but ever since I got in, into Arrow Blu-rays, um, it's been my dream for Arrow Video to acquire this title, the best elements of this title possible, and release a fantastic Blu-ray, which is what they're going to do. This is absolutely fantastic and exciting news, and I've got some early specs here. As I've already said, brand new restoration from a 4K scan of the original negative, which is very, very, very exciting news. This is this news here is really uh, you know good for me, obviously, as well. Coming up, original uncompressed mono audio. Of course, I guess except for rare occasions, Aero Films generally sticks with original mono unless uh, maybe some former distributor distributor has done a 5.1 mix maybe they'll include that as well but I don't think I've got a 5.1 mix of anything that was originally in mono in any of my Arrow video Blu-ray collections and then of course optional English subtitles for the deaf and hard of hearing brand new interviews with cast and crew which will be exciting it'll be interesting to see who they wrangle up to talk about this you know movie that's going on 40 years old original theatrical trailer which is always nice to have reversible sleeve featuring original and newly commissioned artwork by Justin Osborne if I'm pronouncing that correctly and first pressing only collector's booklet featuring new linear notes by writer Lee Gambin so um, UK this is coming out or at least at this point it's supposed to come out in the UK August 21st in the US August 22nd I cannot tell you how excited I am for this news. Um, this Hopefully, you know, I like to have a DVD, hopefully it'd be a DVD combo as well, but if it's not, it's no big deal. I like to have a DVD of it just so for portable DVD players or whatever, but um, I, I cannot even, oh my gosh, um, the artwork here, which I'm showing you guys, is probably the newly commissioned artwork, which, um, which looks, in my opinion, fantastic. I always wondered what the hell the cover would be of this movie if, in fact, they did um, ever release it on Blu-ray and this 
I presumably new com newly commissioned artwork looks pretty good. I mean, it really captures the feeling of, and, and this picture really captures the feeling of the fantastic um, just atmosphere this movie has. Just this remote kind of tropical, maybe in the off season um, island that just you know can't get can't basically escape from this location without you know unless a, you, they were brought there by an, you know an airplane and it's really remote and you know they're basically trapped and stuff like that so kind of a bummer we gotta wait until almost the end of August for this title but uh, whatever at least we got something very very exciting to look forward to as I'm I don't it didn't intend to go on and on about this news but it's just so I mean, I'm just so ecstatic. Like I say, I mean, never since I started buying Arrow DVDs or Blu-rays, rather, this is the outfit that I, if I could have made the choice, this is the outfit that I would have wanted to acquire, preferably the camera negative and do a preferably a 4K scan of and preferably release. And oh my gosh, I, I can't even express how excited I am about this news. And, uh, Wow. So and we're also very fortunate that it's coming out in the U.S. Obviously, as well as you know, for you Brits or people in the U.K. You, so we're both fortunate. It's coming out both here and there. So as opposed to one or the other, it'd be really. Can you imagine if this is just coming out in the U.K. only? And oh my gosh, talk about time to get a Blu-ray player with uh, region-free capability. But anyway, I, I'm going on and on and on because this news is so exciting. But I think I think I pretty much said. All that is known about this particular title or this release at this point in closing if I haven't said it already I'm very excited about this that'll be one good thing about the end of summer to look forward to anyway um, would have been nice to have it you know sometime earlier so we could see it sooner but whatever it's it's uh, with any luck and unless anything goes wrong uh, we'll get it uh, at the end of August so thank you very much for watching this video and as always we'll catch you on the next one